Well, Rex, how did this start? Because you didn't set out to be popular on Twitter, right? No, you know, I played basketball for a long time. And uh, uh, this just kind of, a couple of years ago, I was really frustrated with the toxic social media and kind of went it off. And I watched so much basketball. I, I saw this video of a dolphin swimming out, uh, paddle border swimming in. And a dolphin jumped up and just hit the guy right in the chest. And a stupid basketball term. I said, that's a charge, block or charge. Well, I just tweeted <laughs> it out. People thought it was kind of funny. Um, and then it grew from there. Um, so yeah, I try to try to throw in some good, feel good stuff from time to time to make people laugh. I mean, that dolphin video never gets old. Is it a charge because <laughs> his feet were planted on the surfboard? His feet were see, planted. See. Couldn't go the other way because dolphins you know don't have feet. Oh my God, you know that's sports right. ball. I know so much about sports. People are always like, he does. His feet are set. Look, that's a charge. <laughs> exactly. Eliza I played it. YMCA Perfect. basketball, so I know. Can I, I, I charged a lot. YMCA I got a lot of red flags in lacrosse, so I just know about the aggressive behavior. Oh my God. Yeah. I, love, I love that. Well, Rex, it's pretty cool to find a way to make social media help your mental state um, instead of hurt it. Because I'm gonna be honest with you, I watched The Social Dilemma, I don't know if you ever, if you saw that, but it freaked me out. And I think that, you know, it is kind of daunting, the, the, the film in general, but at the same time, I love that you've used it um, to help with mental health. And how have you managed to do that? Um, like I mentioned at the beginning, I, I played basketball forever. In my last three years of playing, I had seven orthopedic surgeries. and. Right when I finished playing, I wasn't a drinker, a, a smoker, nothing my whole career. And a doctor gave me Oxycontin, and that set me on about a 15-year battle with painkiller addiction, I, three rehab stints. Um, and so finally, about six years ago, I, was, I went to rehab for the, for the third time. It took that time. Uh, I've been off of painkillers for about six years, and uh, I know life is hard. And, uh, you know, I heck, heck, I lived in my car for a little while. I made probably $40 million playing basketball. And since then, I've lived in my car and lived on friends' couches. So um, I can't, I got, I have the greatest debt of gratitude to so many of my family and friends who have supported me through everything. And I think with the Twitter, shoot, I'm just happy to be able to bring a smile to somebody's face and, uh, and happy that so many people share their videos with me. None of the content's mine. They send it to me. I put it out. Yeah, well, you have made me smile a lot. You're hilarious.